Hello there. What? What's up, my NSAPs? Welcome to my channel. All right, so we have made it to episode eight of the Owl House. It's a really long title, so I'm just gonna say it's knock, knock, knocking on Hootie's door. <laughs> you know, so I'm just gonna say Hootie's episode. I'm actually really intrigued to see what this episode's gonna be about. Like, I know it's gonna be about Hootie. You know, there was he was even in the drawing and stuff like that. But there's also been talks online about it being a, a therapeutic episode. Everyone's getting therapy. So this is great. Is this uh, also including therapy for us as viewers? I don't know. We shall see. Before we get into it, guys, make sure to like and subscribe. Go ahead and check me out on my social media accounts where I post art. And that's it. There has been a handful of other memes created from last week's episode where I mentioned that you guys have turned me into a meme, which is awesome. I'll include the link again down below if you missed it last week and you want to make your own. But for the ones that were created, you guys are amazing. Mwah, it's been beautiful. Thank you. All right, well, I'm very intrigued for this episode, so I don't want to waste any more time. Let's get into it. I hope this letter finds you well and that you're enjoying your time with your parents. I'm writing to let you know that I am a genius. Yeah! I'm so proud of you, you weird bird worm. I love you. Hello, Hootsifer. Your letter concerned me. You write of feeling unimportant while Luce, Ida, and King are off on adventures. Aww. But Hootie, you are the Owl House. Yeah. You take care of everyone inside you. If that isn't a worthy purpose, then what is? Aww. That's so cool. What are we doing, Hootie? Sounds like our little demon is becoming a team man. Ugh, why does that sound so wrong coming? Wait, is he like going through puberty? <laughs> First gun. Well, we didn't even get to see like the actual puberty part, but his voice is changing. King's going through puberty. I love that. That's so cute. From you. 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 <laughs> Their moods change like the wind. Those cool. Whoa. I'm oh my god. Ida, why? Are you okay? Damn, girl, what is it with these like freaking Clawthorn sisters and just being way too into their magic shit? Like, girl, sleep. Can you please be quiet? You're scaring the Echo Mouse. And if he's not happy, I'll never make my way in Amity's heart. I mean, make a portal back home. Ah! What did you just say? Go back, go back. Why do you need to fix that go back? If he's not happy, I'll never make my way in Amity's heart. This stop, this stop. Wait, hold on. This is a freaking Hootie episode. What's with this Amity mentioning? Hold on. Woo, it's just like you're triggering me here. I'm, I'm trying to focus on Hootie, man. You just, it just threw me for a loop with that one. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> okay, anyway, we know this. We know, it's okay. You, you'll, you'll get there. I mean, make a portal back home. Sweet. And these three needed my help. Oh God. So I devised the plan of plans. That's I don't know why I fucking love that smile. That's great. It's it's horribly awesome. Oh, hey girl. Love you. Fuck you. Alright, let's get into therapy. Let's do it. Maybe if I figure out what kind of demon I am, I'll know what's going on. Wait, 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 wait. What do these books say? Demon history, so you want to be a demon. Boiling Isles Dictionary, Diary of a Teen Demon. That's what that's what King is turning into a teen demon. Oh my god. Oh poor thing. What is he gonna do? How how is he gonna help him through puberty? Is he gonna have like a, the talk? Oh god, I hope not. Unless oh my god. <laughs> What did he just do? Are we gonna see the inside of Hootie? Oh god, please, God, Dana, no. Please don't show us the inside of Hootie. Did you owl pellet me? Ew! Oh, maybe he just like made a little owl cocoon thing, like a, like a cat's hairball. <laughs> I'm so sorry, King. Does your voice crack in a super embarrassing way? Yes. I have the yes. answers. You're going through demon puberty. <laughs> the last thing I want from you is a health class. <laughs> health class, right? Oh my God! Wait, what? Who am I? Traits fur, chinchilla, pocket monster. <laughs> Fidgety claws, cartoon, super cute. I love that these were the options, because, I mean, to be honest, I make these all of those. Besides, I'm pretty sure I'm the only other demon here, so <laughs> what other choice do you have? Uh, Facts. All right. As a type of worm myself. Bird worm. Get it. Ooh, did she just work? Hey. 
message that they're totally putting here like i see it i recognize it i see what they're doing here but when it comes to the show and information now like then what the hell is king i guess he's not a normal demon then because if he doesn't fit the three types and doesn't share any of the qualities that like they, those types have and they can't figure out what he is then what the heck is he oh he's something special our boy special like we already knew he was special he was a special boy he's our boy but now he's even more special because now it's like okay what is going on with your DNA, my friend? Ooh, this is so intriguing. But also, I love the double-sided message that's going on here. Also, be you! This was perfect! I just got this shirt actually from, where did I get it? Target? Target, the pride section. And I decided to wear it today, and now it's coming in handy. <laughs> Let me just hear that message again, because it's so true. We don't really know what you are, but that's okay, because we don't need to know that to be your friends. That's so cute. I don't have any responses to my video yet or my wanted posters. Oh. Maybe my dad is gone. Maybe no. there's no one else like me. There's this big thing that looks just like you, but bigger. I don't know if that was his dad. Uh, I hope it is, but his dad looked pretty huge in the paintings and the drawings and stuff. So maybe it's like a relative of King, like a distant relative, who knows? But you are related to somebody out there who looks like you. I didn't want to make you mad. Well, I am mad at him for not being here. He left me alone. What the fuck was that? Yeah, I'm Tainos right now. What? I mean, the fact that he just like shot out this magical, like freaking energy boom. But it's not so big. I'm like kind of more fascinated about that. Hold on, what just happened? So he does have magical powers, but different kinds? <laughs> and also it seemed to affect items, but not them. What does that mean? No, no, I'm sad too. At least the cake is good. Oh, it was supposed to be a crumble. No, Please. Please. no, let you try. But I wasn't about to give up. Okay, you good. Okay, yeah, eat any therapy. A reward for all your hard work. He drugged them? Of booty? <laughs> he totally drugged them. Not a bad idea. With some NyQuil Here's in this shit. Yeah, go to sleep. NyQuil. <laughs> Magic NyQuil. Yeah, I knew it! Drug grass. Can I go to sleep, bitch? Sleeping nettles? <laughs> put you to sleep for hours. Sleeping nettles don't just put you to sleep. They heighten your dreams. Oh, shit. Do you realize who you just stuck me with? Oh, no. Please, don't let me fall asleep. Yeah. One bite will put you to sleep for oh, hours. Oh, she's already asleep. For hours. For hours. Fuck. You know, maybe this is an opportunity. The owl beast is why I ran away from home. The owl beast is why I never got close to anyone. And the owl beast... Is that referring to rain, by the way? That's why I don't have magic. Get it. Get it! You haunted me long enough, bird brain. I think it's time for me to haunt you. Woo! Le huh? Oh. What the I was getting excited for a second. Huh. Well, this is a development. Edith, come downstairs, please. Can we just say, let's just take a moment before we see this flashback. Oh, hey! Anyway, side note, I just wanted to give appreciation to the voice actress of young Ida because I just, there's something about her voice. I love it. 
Young Ida's voice is just chef's kiss. Aww, memories. Mother, do you like my napkin folding? Uh, oh, that's nice, sweet flea. Well, let's set up, won't you? Sorry, dream mom. I don't have time for whatever this is. I'm on a mission. <laughs> You're going to say that the night your dad leaves for the mandible. Dad? Hey, pumpkin. Hit it. Oh my god! We have dad! Dad at Clawthorn! I was gonna say daddy Clawthorn, but I just feel like that sounds so bad. No! Oh my god! Okay, wait, let's go back because I paused it right now. I just wanted to pause on his face so he could just stare at it for a second. Now let's hear him out. Hey, pumpkin, here to see me off? Dad! It's so good to see you again. I was only gone for an hour. Hey, I know I won't be home for a while, so that's why tonight. Wait, I remember this now. I'll be leaving in style. <laughs> oh, he's supposed to be cursed already. Wait, did she really do this? I thought I ruin this again. She did. Oh no! Dad, Lilith, call the healing coven now. Oh, did we just see some blood? It wasn't your fault. It was yours. Ida, I. Whoa! What are you doing? Ah! Hi, Ray. You're lying again. It's like I don't really know you. So I've made a decision. Okay, okay, I know how this plays out. I oh, hope that I'll be ready this time. You hear me, bird brain? I'm joining the bard coven, and... No, 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 I hate this part. I think we should see other people. Wait! Wait, 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 wait! This is sad. This is a sad moment. I'm supposed to be sad. Hold on, though. Hold on. We should see other people. So they were dating! Oh my god! I thought they just like had crushed on each other all their lives and then never actually did anything because then they kind of like did their own things with the bar coming and being the owl lady. Oh! So they had broken up! Oh my god, 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 oh my god. That is awesome! Thank you, Owl Crew! By the way, yeah, this is totally therapy episode. I'm loving it. So what kind of therapy is Luce gonna get? It's like, who are you gonna sit her down? Oh, is this one where you maybe find... Cause Data mentioned this season is the one where Luce will say that she is bisexual. I mean, I wonder if that's what this episode is. Maybe she like says it, that'd be great. Anyway, this is supposed to be sad. Let me just get back into that sadness because they're, they're breaking up with her. But like, that was kind of really cool that we know that they were a thing. All right, anyway. I think we should see other people. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ida, it's over. No. Oh my god, wait, did you, did you turn here? This is like... Are you okay? Is this the curse? Yeah. Just tell them. Let them help. <laughs> it's Just tell them! Let them help! The proper pronouns, guys! It's the proper pronouns for me! The respect. Thank you. Dana, seriously, you guys and the crew are seriously changing things up at Disney, and thank you. Seriously for all of this. This is amazing. This is intense though. I'm just like feeling so many mixed emotions. I want to be really happy and excited, but I'm also like really feeling the angst here. So I'm just like a little all over the place. Sorry. You can leave now. I can't do this anymore. Oh, no. Stop pushing them away. <laughs> ah, I'm a punchy bird. <laughs> Get it. Uh oh, where are we? Uh, just a little bit. There's like some tendencies in there. But interesting. So who the fuck are you? It's over. <laughs> oh, I'm so intrigued now. You're so tall. You see how tall they were? The fuck is that? What is you? 
also from the side, it kind of like the top of it kind of looks like an elf shoe. Anyway, that is some scary shit and I'm very intrigued to see who the fuck that is. What just happened? Dude, I got so scared. I was like, oh. Can you just cut the straight? <laughs> I actually kind of feel bad for it. It's like this grumpy little thing. It's okay. Why do I want to cry right now? Look, like, my eyes are watering again. I think they're the reason we can stand here face to face. I'm crying. Listen, if we can't accept each other, this nightmare will never end. So what do you say? Truce? For now? so sweet and cute at the same time like i'm loving this therapy thank you for the therapy dana we needed it and Eda really needed it she's like gonna accept this owl creature thing now maybe now maybe she won't have like those crazy outbursts now maybe it'll be a lot more tame <laughs> it's like sandpaper Aww. oh my god it's like Never had a dream this pretty. Oh, that is beautiful. God, I tell you, they are so good at the art in this show, man. Look at those colors and the stars, the music. That is beautiful. We just had to take a moment to appreciate that, the, the beauty of this art. If you're in the live chat, fill that thing up with some emojis of color for the, for the freaking appreciation of the art behind this show. Absolutely gorgeous. Wow. That's breathtaking. Oh, my head. Huh? Wait, can we see her? Jeez, did I turn again? That's so cute. Okay, so maybe this is what the therapy's gonna be. We gotta, we gotta talk about her feelings. Let's get down to it. I'm ready. I'm ready. Lucy's heart was torn between finding a way home and the pursuit of love. How do I know all that? I just used that L word again. Woo! I said I was ready. Maybe I'm not ready. Amity's smart, cool, and classy. Asking her out should be breathtaking, emotional. And <laughs> Wait, bitch, is she really gonna ask her out at some point? Let's say. If we get an episode where she actually asks her out like that, listen, Disney, are we gonna? Are we, you're gonna let you're gonna let this happen? <gasps> Please. Emotional. Yes. And real. Yes. Everyone back home said I was cheesy. Can't let Amity think the same. She won't think that. She's so head over heels for you, boo boo. You have no idea. Oh God. As we stumble through life, gloom knows no bounds. You will only find love when you're in the ground. Ah. P.S. I mean the basement. Oh my god. Hootie, I don't have time for this. I was like, the fuck? Also, we have a basement? I know, right? He's gonna have like this whole like therapy set. Okay, maybe not. Never mind. Amity? Oh yeah, that's okay. silly. Why would Amity be in our- <gasps> No, she's fucking not- Oh! Yo, listen, 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 I need to, oh, listen, hold 
on. Hold on. No, 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 no. I said I was ready. I don't think I am anymore. Hold on. Amity's in this episode? What the fuck is Amity doing in this episode? I know that I've been complaining about not having Amity in these last two episodes. But listen, because of that, I was prepared to not have her in this episode. Do you, do you know what I'm saying? I thought this was just about Rudy. What the fuck is Amity doing here? I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Because how many more minutes do we have here? Oh, we have seven more minutes left. Hold on. A lot can happen in seven minutes. I don't think I'm ready. I was ready a minute ago and I'm not. Okay, breathe, hold on. We don't even, this one's gonna ask her out. Oh my God, no, shh. Mm. What the fuck is that? Are they gonna talk about like the kiss and stuff? Talk, oh my God, I don't even want to press the face, it's fine. Okay. Where are we? I think Hootie brought me here. Uh, well, this is our basement. I am so sorry about this. Hootie's been acting weird all day. Yeah. <laughs> House demons get like that after a couple of thousand years. So, it's fine. Listen, about what happened at my place, mm -hmm. I kind of, if we could just forget about the no. whole thing, maybe. No. I, hey, uh, all I care about is getting you out of our dirty weird no, basement. No, 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 yes. <laughs> No fucking way. No, 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 no. You're not. You guys aren't doing this to me. No. I wasn't ready for this. I was ready for Hootie. What is this? Is this a Hootie episode? What? What? They landed in the pub. Our pillows. Guys, prepare for a lot more pausing if this is the fucking case, man. I, I'm not ready. Okay, my face is so red right now. Tomato face energy. All right. <sighs> Oh no. No, don't burn it. You're gonna scare her. Just relax. To return to the world above, make your way through the tunnel of No way! No way! Excuse me, she'll think I'm such a loser. No, she won't! What is this? Hootie, I love you. Hootie, 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 I love you so much. I love you so much right now, you weird bird worm. right there is very powerful. It's short, but it's powerful. Oh no, I'm gonna be made fun of again. Dude, that is so sad. Like, as somebody who was bullied in, in elementary, middle school, like all of that, I get it. Like, and it's really sad to see her character not being able to enjoy this right now. Like she's literally in a love boat going through the tunnel of love with this girl that she has a massive crush on and she can't even enjoy it because she thinks Amity is gonna make fun of her. Like that is so, Sad. Oh, you poor baby. I'm so sorry. I totally feel you. But please stop being stupid and just enjoy this, please. Just open your open your eyes and look at her. She's red. She's red in the face. But you um, did you just say guys, she loves it, guys? She loves it. Uh -huh. <laughs> no. Oh, stop. That was uh, an invasive species. Stop. <laughs> God, we're so extra. I see the crew is so extra. Can we make this? And Dana said yes. Oh my god. I'm so sorry, This is not supposed to happen. Don't say that. No! Loose! Loose! Stop! Oh, her face. It's that same face from Grom when she thought she was going to be rejected. Loose. Look at. Just loose. Just look at her. Look what the fuck are you doing? You poor innocent sweet. Dumbass! Look! Oh no, she's gonna make her feel bad. You idiot. This was a nightmare. Oh, you did Yeah, that. it kind of was. No. Oh, get out of your hair. Hey, Amity, wait! This wasn't 
me. This is all Hootie's stupid idea. Yeah, this was stupid. I mean, us dating? <laughs> That's stupid, right? Oh, on. Again. I was supposed to be really sad right now, and I am. I am. But she just said dating. She just said us dating? <laughs> Thank God there's a wall here. I need to brace against something. Look how red my face is. Oh. Don't cry. She's just nervous. Oh. Again. I didn't want to see that again, man. One was enough. out in this episode this is not happening we're on episode eight this is so early in the season you know what happened <laughs> it's probably because they had news that their season three was going to be cut short into just like three 40 minute episodes that dana was like all right we were gonna have a longer uh relationship arch with these two but y'all want to fuck around and cancel us we're just gonna shove it all in right away i love it i'm here for it no way okay <laughs> What was Hootie trying to do? Quick, pretend he helped you before he destroys everything. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it! Sorry. He was trying to help me ask Amity out. Oh, whoa. Do you wanna? Mm -hmm. oh, do it! Like this? Oh, that's so cute! Then do it! Like, it's so normal. It's so normal. I love it. I love how normal it is. Like, this is huge, guys. Like, for, for those of you who are around my age, you know, in our 20s and stuff like that, we're grown adults. <laughs> Debatable. Grown adults. But we grew up with uh, heteronormative media, magazines, comics, art, everything. Like, everything around us was heteronormative. We didn't have shows like this. So to know that this is existing right now for kids who are growing up and maybe going through the same thing, this is absolutely awesome. And to see it being normalized is fantastic. Props to the OWL team, props to Dana, Disney, you're getting there. You know, maybe the top execs are still assholes and stuff, but the ones who are allowing and, and trying to push this media out more and are actually wanting this kind of diversity, good for you guys. Bravo, way to change the norm. I, I would love to see more of this kind of stuff. This is great. Good luck, kid. Oh my gosh, she's gonna do it. She's gonna do it. She's gonna fucking do it. She's gonna fucking do it. She's gonna fucking do it. Oh my God, oh my God. I was not expecting this. Oh my gosh, Amity, are you okay? I'm all right. Wait, I was just... Are we getting that handheld thing? Because look at the background. Look at the background, it's from the, the trailer. Look, it's the wi flying thing. Oh, shit. Oh my, hold on, I gotta breathe, I gotta breathe, I gotta breathe. I'm not ready. I'm not ready for whatever the fuck is about to happen. I, what the fuck is happening, guys? This is supposed to be a hootie episode. What? I've been wanting to ask you something for a while. But I wanted to do it in the best way. No fucking and way. in the tunnel of love, I thought, damn it, he's too cool for this. I'm not as cool as you think. Stop, stop. Okay. Stop. Everything is so crazy right now, and I have no idea what my future holds, but it would be so cool if you were in it. So, stop. stop. Uh, say it. Say it. Say it. <sighs> do you want to go out with me? No, I was already. Amity Blight, do you want to go out with me? Ah! No fucking way! No fucking way! No way! No way! I'm rewatching it because I'm too overwhelmed right now to fully appreciate it. Oh my god, my throat is hurting by from how much I'm screaming. I need to like drink a tea after this. This is not good for me. No fucking way, guys. No fucking way. We are getting canon Lumini. We we did just get it. Lumini is canon. <laughs> I need 
way to fully appreciate it. <laughs> Do you want to go out with me? No, <gasps> oh, I was so ready. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, you can see it. <gasps> okay. Amity Blight, do you want to go out with me? Yes! Oh my God, okay. so cute! Hold her hand, hold her hand, hold her hand. There it is, there it is! I knew it! Oh, the phone! Oh my God, your phone! Man! Oh my God, your phone! Stop, it's too cute! Oh my God! Oh, now I'm sweating! <laughs> oh my God, you guys, this is awesome! Still so scary. Oh. I don't know. I don't know, Hootie. You really are something. Yeah, Hootie. Oh, he made a heart! He made a heart! And Lucy's new GM showed her tips and tricks to get more information from Adam. Lucy's new GF? Official girlfriend title? No fucking way! Disney! Yes! Dana! All crew! I thank you so much this for this episode. I cannot thank you enough. Oh my gosh, you guys are fucking amazing. Thank you for pushing this change, man. This is awesome, and you guys are doing it beautifully. Bravo! Also, what the fuck did I just pause on? So they're learning more about the portal. Look at the portal, guys. So it does look like it's human tech mixed with magic shit. So... I wish it wasn't scribbled. I wanted to see what those words say. So we've got some math and stuff here. It looks like portal, what's in between? Interesting, trying to figure out. Okay, this is some Einstein shit, but uh, okay. Getting a little bit more information. I mean, not really, but kind of a little bit more. It's diary. Okay, who gets the spider uh, talisman? What is that about? Seriously, what is that about? Is that gonna be Boos's? I don't know. It's pretty cool though. What? Okay, now that I'm looking at him again up close, hmm, is he dad that or is he just relative? I don't know. I'm intrigued though. He's definitely related somehow, but I don't know if that's his dad. Maybe like uncle, grandfather, you know, whatever. But I love it. And I'm very intrigued to see who the fuck you are. And when you see this finds its way to King Clothon. Oh my God. Oh my gosh, a bug! Hootie, no! Whoopsie, hope that was junk mail! Are you fucking serious? Listen, stop, you can't do that! Wait, what the hell was in the- Oh, he better shit that out or something later, I fucking swear. Hootie, you- I literally went from loving Hootie with everything I had to literally wanting to bitch slap him in the face and within five seconds. Oh my god, is that it? Is that where it ends? Oh my god, you, you've got to be fucking kidding me. and Hootie, and that is all I was expecting out of this episode. We got Canon Lumini, guys. We got a badass superhero, Ida, now combined with the owl. We got King with superpowers, now going through puberty and shit. And we got Lumini. Confirmed, Canon. Girlfriends. Guys, this is huge. Bravo to the team. Bravo to everybody involved who gave the okay for this. You guys are absolutely Fantastic. Oh my gosh. I'm kind of bummed that the theory of that moon person wasn't Amity. I really would have liked that whole like, you know, vigilante thing, you know, but it's okay. We'll figure out who that is hopefully later because she seemed really intriguing actually, equally so. Holy shit guys, I need to like, I'm gonna rewatch this probably a hundred times for sure. Oh my God, how are you guys feeling? Let me know in the premiere chat or down in the comments what is going through your mind right now. What was your favorite episode in that? Sorry, what was your favorite moment in this episode? I can't even talk right. I am like so <laughs> overwhelmed right now. I need to take a break, but this was absolutely amazing. Not at all what I was expecting, but I'm so happy that we got it. Also, it was confirmed that Ida and Ray were dating. For real, that is also confirmed. They just broke up. That's so sad. Well, hopefully they get back together because Ida has to save them for her. Woo, wow. 
Thank you guys so much for tuning in. This was definitely a roller coaster of emotions. Holy shit, was not expecting any of it. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. Go ahead and follow me on my social media accounts for art and other cool stuff. Wow, wow, wow. I hope you guys can settle and relax. Actually, no, fuck that. Let's not settle and relax. We gotta celebrate, baby.